Oh, it's, it's just one game. Um, but I'm just curious, just the defense overall, how would you assess which one did it's in the first half or is just the second half? You know, it's, it's, it's the first game. Uh, first game is always the toughest. It's, it's always, you know, it's always about playing clean, um, being disciplined. And we played good, not great. You know, we made it, we made too many mistakes. Uh, but when it came down to it, you know, we, we put our hands in the dirt and we made plays. Um, and, and that's what this game comes down to. It's not, not going to be perfect. Um, so for us to just go out there and, and do what we do and, and make plays when plays need to be made, that's all that matters. Third down, you stopped almost the entire time. Fourth down, the ball. Is that one thing to hang your hat on? Of course, of course. That's that's one of the biggest parts of the game. If you can get off the field and, and put the ball in the lock in his hands, you're, you're going to win the game for a long time. Um, so when, when we can be successful at that, I have a lot of confidence in, in not only our defense, but in our offense to put up some points. On top of that, you guys were really good on like third and one, fourth and one. But what are the keys to those plays where maybe you have less than a second, it's just bodies piling up uh, before you have a chance to do it? Yeah, it, it comes down to toughness. Um, and we've been pushing that all off season. Um, and you know, in the workouts we do, and, and the everyday thing we do, um, toughness is, is one of the pillars of our house. So when we get to those situations, we know we have to be the best, and we know we will be the best because of the work we put in the off season. Um, and then, like, like I said before, execution. And when, when you take care of the things you need to take care of, good things happen, and, and we are able to get off the field in those situations today. Buffalo's got a couple of talented backs in Cook and Washington, but you guys, for the most part, were pretty good against the run. They didn't have as many yards for carries. How are you guys able to slow down that rush attack? Um, you know, I, I think effort is a lot of it. You know. Every 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 second, every play, um, you need to be going 100 percent, 100 percent the entire time, um, and I think we did that in most cases. So that, you know, is a big factor in getting their ball carries to the ground. Yeah, they, they were talented for sure. Um, you know, we weren't able to get them down every play. We had missed tackles, um, but it's the rallying to the ball that I think really, really, you know, sets the tone and, and makes the difference there. A lot. When when Mongo was hired, I think a lot of fans heard the words air raid and. Oh my God! What about the running game? From a defensive player's perspective, do you still look at this offense and go, if teams don't stop one and zero and zero and one, it's going to be a long One hundred percent. You know, we, in my opinion, we have the best backfield in the country, uh, hands down. And when you have those two guys back there and, and you can't stop it, it, yeah, it will be a long game. Uh, the defense is going to get worn down, and, and those two just work. You know, they go out there every snap, and then their goal is to get in the end zone, and they do that. And we saw it multiple times tonight. Um, so I, I, I'm ecstatic for those two. They put in the work this offseason, and it's showing, and, you know, it's going to show in time season. You guys just multiple as you thought you'd be going in. You kind of saw some of the dollars, you saw some of the 2 4 5. You, is it kind of what you guys expected going in? Yeah, yeah, it was. You know, we, we, we had a game plan coming in. Um, you know, we didn't really know exactly what Buffalo was going to run. We, you know, with the new OC, um, so, you know, we had ideas of what we were going to do, and, and, you know, we run the plays that the coach calls, um, and we executed them well enough to get to get off the field. Um, you know, I think we had, we had a good game overall I mean, in terms of, you know, the multiplicity. Um, we did see those those packages and, and the change-ups and mix-ups, and I think that's what's going to make our defense special as the year goes on. Hunter, when you talk about setting the tone, you had two early nice run fits led to that uh, early punt. Kind of, how important is that for you, and especially now you being in your spot with Torch now going? I mean, that's big. You know, when you can get off the field, it makes the game a lot easier. So to be able to step up in the run game um, and help the team out and go make those plays, it, it's huge. It, me it means a lot, you know. We get a stop on third down. Um, they plan to go for it on fourth down. They get a false start, and they punt. That's, I mean, that's, when, when you get opportunities, you have to take advantage of them. You have to maximize them. And, you know, when, when we had those opportunities tonight, we did that. And Luke talked call. a little bit about anxiousness. Um, did it just take a little bit to kind of tell guys, okay, you know, yeah, it's a new era, but let's settle down. And let's let's get to business, so to speak. Definitely. You know, there's there was a lot of guys nervous coming into this game, myself included. Um, and, you know, as to be expected, it's a new coach, new staff, um, new players on the team. New year, first game's always always nerve wracking. Um, so yeah, it, it took a second to settle in, um, and we did what we needed to do. We came in here, we took business, and, and we defended the camp. 